What's up, guys? Ricky Rebo here with Ricky Rebo RC. Hi, so this is the car we're going to be converting to a Traxxas Rustler. Alright guys, so like I said, I'm converting this car. It started life out as a bandit. You know, um, it just it didn't do the best. Like, a, It's not a good car for a new basher, I guess you could say. Um, I got nothing against the bandit. It's a cool little buggy. I drove it when my uh, nephew had it. You know, I had fun with it. But... I feel like you got to be a little more experienced with that car, and he just likes to bash, you know? He's a 13-year-old kid, and he just likes to bash. So, I got stuck. I got a mess here, as you guys can see. I didn't feel like cleaning it up this time, you know? Usually, it's all nice and tidy, but this time, I just, I don't care. This thing is just, you know, these crashes so many times, I had bent screws, busted parts. I'm just pulling it apart, putting it back together. But, uh, yeah, so we went ahead... You know, it's looking great, you know. So we'll take a look at it here. All right, so let's take a closer look here. Let me make sure I don't have anything silly up here. Like I said, I got a mess, guys. I mean, just a mess. My Wraith, I burned up the speed controller, going back and forth, switching stuff out. But anyway, that's not what this video is about. So, like I said, I'm turning the Traxxas Bandit into a Rustler. And really, I mean... All I did was I went online, you know, hopped on one of those online chop shops, and I got the control arms. The control arms came with the C-hubs, all stock parts. I mean, cheap, you know. The control arms, the C-hubs, new bearings. I mean, the hexes, the hubs are on there. Came with wheel nuts. I mean, all together for the control arms and stuff like that. I think I paid front and rear, and the rear came with axles, everything. All new grub screws and stuff. I think everything was... Definitely under a hundred bucks. I mean, you could see I got the anodized red links. You know, those were a little more. I could have just got the stock ones way cheaper, but you know, I kind of wanted to do something nice for my nephew. You know, so so yeah, there we go. This is what I've been working on. This is the project I told you about that the Deadpool body's going on, and uh, I think it's coming out pretty good. Um, like I said, you know, all the front end stuff, all the suspension stuff is done. Well, as far as the control arms and camber links, tow links, all that good stuff. Uh, axles are in, you know, it's it's coming along. I'm actually just waiting on uh, some aluminum shock caps and uh, some new springs, and I can actually put those together. And really, once I get all those, all that on, um, I mean, it's pretty much good to go, you know. Tidy up a few things and take the thing out, you know. Beat it up. Well, actually, I'm going to take it out. I'm going to give it to him first. I'm going to show him how it's coming out, you know. He's, he's been asking me about it for weeks now, so months so once it's done i'm gonna give it to him but uh yeah so that's the update guys so this is the uh traxxas bandit turning into a uh rustler so stay tuned and uh you guys see how it come out and then we'll do some running videos and all that good stuff and uh we'll see how it goes thanks for watching guys don't forget to like comment subscribe and if you got any questions about anything you know you you just want to talk about some stuff you know whatever just throw it down in the comment section below and, you know, I'll answer. You know, I always answer. I always check them. So, thanks, guys. Catch you later.